Ammonite fossils are a popular remain of extinct marine creatures that are known for their very intricate spiral patterns as well as their very unique shapes. However, what tends to set ammonites apart from other fossils on occasion is their remarkable display of vibrant and striking colour, a phenomenon that's often casually assumed to be some kind of synthetic metal wash by merchants, but this is in fact a very, very natural phenomenon. The vibrant colours that can occasionally be seen on ammonite fossils are the result of the mineralisation process that takes place after that ammonite dies. As the ammonite shell becomes buried in sediment, minerals such as iron, manganese and copper seep into the shell over time, replacing the organic material and mineralising it. What I think is very interesting is the fact that the specific mineral that enters the ammonite shell actually determines the colour that will be displayed on the fossil. For example, iron minerals can give the fossil a reddish brown hue, whilst manganese can create a black or dark brown colour. Copper can result in blue or green hues, and the distribution and concentration of these minerals can result in unique and intricate colour patterns that make each ammonite very unique. In addition to mineralisation, the presence of other materials in the sediment surrounding the ammonite shell can also influence the colours displayed on that fossil. For example, the presence of organic matter can lead to yellow or brown hues, whilst red or orange hues may result from the presence of iron oxide in the sediment. It's probably important to note that the colours on ammonite fossils are not always visible immediately after they're uncovered. In some cases, the colours can only be revealed after the fossil has been prepared and then cleaned, as the minerals and organic matter can be covered by sediment or other materials that need to be removed. To summarise, ammonite fossils offer a fascinating display of colours that result from the mineralisation process and the presence of other materials in the surrounding sediments. These colours are not only visually stunning, but they also provide valuable information about the environment and the geological conditions in which the ammonites lived and then died. Whether displayed in a museum or used for research purposes, ammonite fossils continue to captivate audiences with their beautiful and unique pinwheel-like colours. <laughs>